Hi guys! I hope everyone's doing well. I know it's been a long time again since I've made a video. Um, had a really busy week, had lots of stuff going on. Um, kids with school stuff and um, just a bunch of other stuff going on. So, um, yeah, so there was just a lot going on. Maybe I'll put the camera on myself while I just chat with you guys really quick. There we go. Oh, I have to look down. There's Ivan way over there. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so I had a lot going on. I, um, as you guys know, I um, took a test for um, my licensing for um, selling insurance and I failed the test <laughs> horribly. <laughs> Um, and I feel like I studied my butt off, like seriously, I feel like I studied a lot. Um, so I don't know, um, why I felt it. Um, I guess there's just a lot to learn that I just, you know, just didn't get. And so, um, so yeah, so that's what's going on with that. Um, I was okay with it. I wasn't surprised and I wasn't, um, upset about it. <laughs> I did. Um, I was okay with it and after, um, going to work that day and talking with my boss, we decided that, um, I wasn't, I'm not going to go for my license again for a while. I am going to just do, um, you know, service stuff for him and the other agent that we have in the office. Um, I'm very happy with that decision, um, and I've decided to work part-time. I have found that working part, or I mean, working full-time while trying to take care of my kids and, um, other stuff that we got going on was just kind of taking its toll on me, and, like, we were never having a dinner, um, because, you know, I wasn't here to cook, or when I did, it was a very late dinner, um, and I just felt like, okay, I'm coming home at 5.30 and then I'm going to bed at 9. So I'm going to bed, you know, four and a half hours, wait, six, seven, eight, no, three and a half hours after I got home, I'm going to bed. And, um, yeah, I go to bed at 9 o'clock, you guys. <laughs> um, well, I mean, I'm not like in bed at 9 o'clock, but yeah, I'm a party pooper. <laughs> um, so anyway, so I'm very happy with my decision. Um, as you guys know, m one of my passion is reborning. I absolutely love reborning. I love painting the baby. I, I, I love every step of reborning. So that's what I'm going to be doing for my, um, you know, to fill in for that, um, um, lack of a full-time job. So that's what I decided to do. And I'm very happy tomorrow, which is Monday. That's probably when this video is going to go up. So it'll be today actually. I'll try to get this video up tonight, but I don't know if I will. Um, tomorrow starts my new work hours, and I'm very happy. So I will be at work from 8.30 in the morning until 1.30. That gives me plenty of time to come home and pick up my kids and do anything else that I need to do. So, um, yeah, so I'm pretty excited about it. Um, and I'm really happy, more than anything, that I can, you know, I'll still be doing my reborns. So please excuse the mess on my bed. I'm washing my bedding. So it doesn't look very pretty in here right now. But, um, so I'm going to go ahead and change Caitlin. And, oh my gosh, I'm going to tell you guys all about my fiasco with Kohl's.com. That's the store Kohl's. Oh my God. I'm going to tell you guys all about it while I change her. They're part of the reason why I haven't made a video. Because <laughs> I want to do a haul video for you guys, but freaking Kohl's is never delivering my order. Oh my gosh, I'm so mad. So, but anyways, we're going to change Caitlin. And I'm going to tell you guys all about Kohl's and why I'm never ordering from them again. <laughs> Even though they actually had the best deals, which is why I ordered from them um, in the beginning. Um, so even Target took a long time. Like, Target took more than a week and a half to deliver my order. And that's not too bad. Um, a lot better than Kohl's. But still, like when you order something, you don't want to wait that long. And I think um, I even paid um, for quicker shipping, if I'm not mistaken. 
So, okay, let's show you what Caitlin's gonna wear. I showed you guys this in a haul video last week. This is what I got at Costco. And I think it was $8.99. And it is Carter's. And I just think it's so cute. And it has this little vest. So it's so cute. So that's what I'm going to put on her. Um, okay, so I ordered from Target and Kohl's on the same day, which was the day after Black Friday. So it was a Saturday. And when I ordered it, it said that my estimated delivery time was like almost a week later. I think it was like the following Thursday. So like five days later, which is usually the normal shipping speed when even when you, you know, don't order, you know, pay for express. So I'm like, okay, well, that's perfect. So I was expecting it that week. Well, it never came and either did Target and I was really surprised and I kept checking the tracking number and it kept like changing and then Target. What? Um, Target had me getting my order, um, let's see, I, I don't even remember what day. Target had me getting my order, I think that following Saturday, so I ordered it on a Saturday and it was scheduled to be here the following Saturday, which I was okay with. Yeah? Can I come in? Yeah. Um, shut the door all the way, please. Thank you. Um, so anyways, um, well, my target order didn't come until this past Wednesday. It was a week and a half after I ordered it. Okay, not that big a deal. I'm still kind of upset. I'm like, well, oh well. It came, and I'm very happy with it. Very, very happy. And I can't wait to show you guys. But I'm waiting for Kohl's to come. So anyways, so Kohl's, when it updated it last week, it didn't have it coming I checked it last weekend, so today is Sunday, so a week ago I checked it, and it said it was scheduled to be here Tuesday, and I'm like, okay, well, you know, whatever, that's pretty late, but okay, fine, so I checked it again on Monday to make sure, and then it said it was going to be here Wednesday, and I was just like, what? I was surprised, and then... So, um, when Tuesday came, I checked to make sure it was going to be here Wednesday. Sure enough, it changed it to Thursday. And then, yes, you've guessed it. When I checked it on Wednesday, it changed it to Friday. So, I was pretty upset, and then, but it just kept changing. And then, I checked it again on Friday, and then it said Saturday. And, um, so I'm just like, okay, whatever. So I checked it on Friday, it still said Saturday, and except for one thing in that order was scheduled to be here Monday. And I was just kind of like, well, that's kind of weird. Why would just one thing I ordered like, let's see, two, four, six, eight or ten things, I think eight. And one thing was scheduled to be here Monday, which I thought was kind of weird. Um, so anyway, so yesterday I checked it again, and it did say that it came to my, where I live, in Anderson, California, or Redding, we're more well known for Redding, um, it, that it got here in, uh, I mean, at 1 o'clock in the morning, and it's being delivered by UPS, and that it was in my town at 1 o'clock in the morning. So I'm like, okay, good, so it will be here today. All day I waited. I got a FedEx order, and at first I thought that was it, but that was something I ordered my daughter for Christmas. Um, and so, uh, the UPS truck never came, even though it was on the truck out for delivery. The UPS truck never came, and I was so upset, and, um, and even up until when I went to bed last night, it still said the estimated delivery was um last night and so that's what i was expecting so it never came and i don't know why it even never even updated that it was ever delivered or anything but um so now here we are sunday i checked it again and now it's saying it's going to be here tomorrow so i really hope it is i really want to show you guys what i got 
and um, yeah, and I really need to get it. I'm getting ready to finish rooting a Saskia. Look how cute this is. I'm getting ready to finish rooting a Saskia, and I need some of those clothes. And then I also got um, my, for my personal collection, my twin A is almost done. Although I have to root her still, so that's going to be a while. And also twin B. Um, so I'm going to need some clothes for them. <laughs> and I have some people inquiring about having a baby made. Um, and I need to have some clothes for them. And, you know, I mean, if I have to go down to Walmart and get some clothes, I will. Walmart's not that bad. I mean, I love Walmart. But I just thought it'd be nice to have something nice, like, you know, Carter's, like this. Um, I love Carter's. I think it's one of my favorite brands. Look how cute that is. Oh my goodness. Should I zip this jacket? Oh, I don't know. Okay, let's put your shoes on. And then I'll decide if I want to zip your jacket. So, yeah, I don't know, you guys. It's so frustrating. When you order something and you think it's going to be there within a week and it ends up being over two weeks. And thank goodness I didn't need, I don't need them today. Um... I mean, some stuff that I needed from Target, I needed when, um, that weekend because I had finished the two custom twin A's that I did. And, um, I knew I was going to finish them that weekend and that's when they were scheduled to be here. And then all of a sudden it said it wasn't coming until Monday and here it is Friday and I had the twins done. And this was last week, of course. And I had those twins done, and I wasn't going to wait until Tuesday to ship them. I mean, I wanted to ship them that Friday. And then when Target didn't come, I wanted to ship them Saturday, but they still didn't come. And go thank goodness I didn't wait, because I didn't even get them until Wednesday. So, yeah, I'm not too happy with Target and Kohl's. I, I know, I understand that, you know, it's December. A lot of the, um, you know, American mail carriers are busy this time of year and I know there's been some weather um, happening on the East Coast and I mean I, I get all that but it's still just kind of frustrating you know when you're expecting something and it doesn't come so that's what happened that's my story you guys and hopefully my clothes will come tomorrow and then I can make my haul video because I'm very excited to show you guys some things that I got and some stuff I got from Target, oh my gosh, there's something I got for Caitlyn. I'm dying to put it on her. But I've had this outfit for longer, and I've been dying to put this on her. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to end up having like a little like online yard sale um, pretty soon because I have a lot of clothes. I think a lot of you guys can relate that, you know, we buy new clothes for our babies. Um... And we like to have new clothes, so then we end up having too many. <laughs> so I think I'm going to end up selling some of Caitlin's wardrobe so we can make room for more stuff. <laughs> and I can't wait to have my twins done. And I have another baby coming that I'm super, super, super excited about, but I'm not going to announce it yet. Um... But I'm super excited. There we go. Oh, I just messed up your hair. I wonder. Yeah, I think that's a good sign. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, my goodness. See, and this is why we like getting new clothes, you guys. Because we always think that the next outfit we get is the cutest. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look how cute. Caitlin actually only has a few outfits that I'm totally attached to that she has worn more than probably five times. Um, a couple of them are gifts that we got from Auntie Katie from My Little World. Look at this, you guys. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute in this. It fits her perfectly. Look, it has little pockets. Oh my goodness, you guys. You guys see her up close. <laughs> Say hi, aunties. Say hi. Look how cute she is. Oh my goodness, Caitlin. You look adorable in this outfit. You want a pacifier? Let's see if we can find one that matches what you're wearing. I need a white one. I think I have a white one. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, look at this, you guys. Here's a white one, but it doesn't have a magnet on it. Oh, my gosh. I have another one that I love, and I don't know why there's no magnet. Oh, look, that one would have been perfect. Oh. That one would have been perfect for you, Caitlin. Darn it. Okay. What about, you got an elephant one. It doesn't match what you're wearing, but it sure is cute. Hmm. What about this one? Nope. Okay, then. Well, then... Okay, yeah, I need to go get a magnet on that one. We'll just give you this one with your caterpillar. There we go. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, my goodness. Excuse this mess back here, you guys. I'm going to put some of this away so you guys aren't just looking at this big mess. Okay, you guys. Well, I better get going. I think our dinner is ready. And I'm just sitting in here. And it looks like I gotta get my bed made. And it's almost bedtime for this mama. But okay, you guys. Well, thank you for watching. My beautiful little Caitlin. Um, thank you for watching, you guys. Um, now that I'm gonna go back to working part time, I'll be able to make some more videos, which I'm excited about. And um, I'm excited about my twins. Oh, I'm so pretty excited about them. Um, but I gotta finish rooting this other Saskia I have. She's